hello guys welcome to my channel in this video i'll be showing you how to draw an ellipse using the focus directrix method or eccentricity method we have been given a question the distance of the focus from the directrix is equal to 50 millimeter and eccentricity is 2 over 3. also draw tangents and normal at any point q on the curve using directrix so first we are drawing our straight line now we are going to be drawing a perpendicular line to this straight line which is going to be like this like this so we can label here as point a and this place as point b then we label here as as point c as point c so from point c to be picking 15 millimeter 15 millimeter from point C so this is going to be our point F which is the focus as the point F so we are going to divide this line CF into four equal parts that's going to be 10 10 millimeter so that will be 10 10 10 and 10 so after dividing it we can label here but that's two divisions from point F we label it as point V since we have been given our eccentricity to be 2 over 3 so this will be 2 over 3 that we label here as point V as point V so from our point V we are going to be picking our compass from point V to point F okay from point V we pick our compass to point F and draw an arc we'll be drawing an arc so after drawing the arc from point V we draw the vertical line straight so we leave it here as point E so from here we draw a straight line passing through from point C here to passing through E draw a straight line upward so from point f we draw we use our angle 45 degrees s square that's we are picking 45 degree we draw a straight line from point f to this point so we can label this point as point p as point d let's label it as point d so from point d we are going to be drawing a vertical line downward so I label this point V prime so now when you are done with drawing this you are going to be dividing from here we are going to be dividing it into equal parts we are going to be using one one centimeter so I will pick from V to V from V here we are going to be using one one centimeter so i pick like this one centimeter each so now we have divided it by one one centimeter now we are going to be drawing vertical lines from each point that we have picked so we are going let me label this as point one this point F and also to this point 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and let me say this point 12 so from point 1 we we'll draw a vertical line downward like this go to point 2 also also draw a vertical line like this 11 uh, this the 12th point so we have drawn vertical lines straight now we label this point as point p1 p2 p3 p4 p5 p6 p7 p8 p9 p10 a p11 and p12 so now we are going to be picking from point 1 to P1 on our compass. 
mp.1 to p1 we'll place it at point f and then mark mark on point one after picking point one to p1 we place it on point f then mark p1 that line one up and down so we we'll place it from point two to p2 also that's already on the point two as this we mark up and down so we pick point three to p3 also from point 3 to p3 we place it on point f our compound on point f we mark up and we mark down so we place it, our compound on point 4 to p4 to p4 let's not do it to p4 and place it on f then we mark our up here and we also mark it down so now we place it on point 5 again to p5 that's to p5 place it on point f mark here and mark here we are picking our points so from point 6 also to p6 to p6 we place it on point f also like this mark our point here mark our point from point 7 to p7 point 7 to p7 place it on point f mark here and mark here from point 8 to p8 like this place it on point f mark here and mark here from point 9 to p9 to p9 place it on point f like this mark here and mark here point 10 to p10 Place it on point F also. Mark here and mark here. From point 11 to P11. So we place it on point F like this. Mark here and mark here. Then from point 12 to P12. Place it on point F. I'm going to be marking here and marking here. Then um, from our point V1 to point D here, here it should be the same length from point V to point V1, which is like that. So these are our points that we are going to be drawing from this point here, here. points so we have picked our points now we are going to be drawing our ellipse so drawing our ellipse, we are going to be using our French curve. You can also use a broom, depending on which one is convenient for you. So I'll pick these points like this. We have drawn that place, so we draw here also. Here also, like this. And we mark this point also like this. This so so we'll be drawing the down part like this. And 
pen like this then we can draw this like this and then finish up with this So now we have gotten our, our ellipse. We have gotten our ellipse. So if you found this video helpful, kindly share, subscribe, and like the video. Thank you.